here's a reaction to the PDBBD whatever podcast with Bassam Yusuf. Reaction. So, of course, the guy is a top G. The guy's amazing. The guy is, what he's doing, most Muslims will never be able to do to speak out against the system. But, but, uh, let me just say overall, I love the guy. Overall, he's an amazing guy. Super duper amazing. But I hate it when they ask a question and you know he knows the answer to it, but he's too scared to say it. You know, like, for example, the thing he says, why did America, why does America support Israel when it's doing all this genocide? Why does it keep supporting it? Why does it keep sending billions and billions of dollars every single year? Why? The answer is simple. Biden said it himself. If there wasn't an Israel, they would create an Israel. That's how much they need it because of money, power. The system of the Dajjal, it didn't start a little while ago. It's been there. The signs of it have been for a long time now. I don't know when exactly, but you know what they did to the to Africa. You know what they did to the Indian subcontinent. Yeah, millions died there as well. Yeah, because of them, famine through war. Yeah, just by taking away the people in India's food, they killed millions of Indians. Yeah, that's our Muslims as well. And they look what they did to Africa with the slavery. They did it. Yeah, the same exact bloody people did the same thing now. They're doing destabilizing the Middle East because it was getting powerful, destabilizing China because China was getting powerful. That was again, whatever, in the past, yeah, over 50 years ago, what they did to China. Yeah, world wars, all to destabilize other countries. Yeah, Ottomans got destroyed in the world wars, got vanished, no more. I'm in Turkey now, moved there. So if you're interested in moving to Turkey, you can contact me as well. The email will be below. You can join our Telegram groups anyway, and I can send you an information pack. So coming back to the point, it didn't start now, it started a long time ago. So any moron who still doesn't understand what their purpose is and why they're doing it, smack yourself in the face. So the reality is when he was asked, why is America supporting them? Because Israel and America and the West are part of the Jal. They want to destroy the Muslim countries. Why doesn't the Arab countries stop fighting? Why do they not stop uh, you know, putting their arms out and think about the economy? Because you don't bloody let them and they will never let them. They will never let you. Why do you think? Turkey can't join EU, it's a Muslim country. Why do all the Arab countries, whenever they get some sort of power or some sort of unity, these guys destroy it? What did Libya do? What did the Iraq, Iraq uh, uh, government do? Yeah, the uh, Saddam Hussein. What did uh, Gaddafi do? They were trying to unite the Arabs. Nah, mate, that ain't gonna happen. So what did they do? They destroyed you from the inside because you're a bunch of idiots. Most of us Muslims are a bunch of idiots. <laughs> I'm not gonna say it, yeah? But you know what I mean? We're so stupid and thick headed. And you still want to support them? You want to still want to live with them? You want to be with them? It's a shame. This is why you need to understand where are you living? Who are you supporting? Who are you part of? Think, please think. Make istikhara, make dua to Allah to show us what the right path is. There is no right country. I don't know where the right place is, but we've moved to South Turkey. For us, this is the best place. And according to the end times, according to the hadith, hopefully this place will survive because I'm not climbing no mountains to join the guy. Yeah? Here, yeah, it's much more easier.